Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. You already know I'm here with a special guest today. Yes, sir, it's your boy Bibosi. <laughs> yeah, go subscribe to him. His link will be in the description. You already know. So we're gonna be doing Would You Rather for this video. We already did one on his channel, so you can go check that out. Part two. Yeah, this is part two. So you wanna go first? Okay. Um would you rather be rich but have no love or have love but like be broke? <laughs> <laughs> be rich with no <laughs> <laughs> I think man be rich with no love man. Really? <laughs> but like I feel like it's so lonely. Like don't you think it's lonely? Like having all that money and then like just no one to share it with. Like who are you gonna go on a trip with? Your guys you know. <laughs> yeah, but they're just girls that like don't love you. They just want you for your money. And then they're really like they're taking back the money you give them and giving it to some other guy that they love. <laughs> or like That's right? the point. So you just do on your own and just cheat. <laughs> <laughs> just be on your own. Yeah. It's sad. But I guess money like, solves all your problems. Like that'd be nice. So Awesome. Yeah, you could have people, but you will not find love. Yeah, and you never know if those people are around you because, like, they actually fuck with you or just like want your money. It's kind of fake. <laughs> anyway, yeah, something to think about. Um, yeah, your turn. Okay. Would you rather? Would you rather suck toes? What? Suck toes. Oh, okay. Oh, eat ass. <laughs> um, I'd probably rather suck toes because, like, once you eat ass, like, there's no, there's no coming back to that. Like, you know, it's like, eh, like, you know, suck a toe. I mean, like, I don't know if you know, but, like, what's her name? Like, AJ or what? Do you know Selena Powell? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, she's like a, um, like, the, like, rapper industry hoe. And she's fucked all, like, all these different rappers. Like, Tory Lanez, mm. 6 9 like all of them, whatever. And like her best friend like sucked toes on her Insta story like recently. I just thought that was funny. But some girls are freaky like have that. Have you ever done that? No. I haven't done that. I haven't, no. But like I've gotten my toes sucked before. But the UK guys, they, they love you. Like, Do they? Yeah. I don't uh, know. I met like one guy with a foot fetish and I was like, I don't know. Like it wasn't like I was doing any foot stuff. It was just like he was into my feet and I was like, that's kind of weird, but the like UK, whatever. The UK, like they love it. <laughs> <laughs> the UK. Yeah. My dad's from there. <laughs> he liked it. My dad liked his elbow being stuck. <laughs> it was weird. Like, not that I know. Like, holy fucking like my mom. My mom is into some weird guys. Anyway, <laughs> okay, I'll go. Um, would you rather make like one million? No, not one million. Mm, like 200,000 a year doing something where you work under people or would you rather work or make 50,000 and you're like your own boss and you have your own like thing going on or let's make it 20k 20k or 200,000 <laughs> I could work on this one you rather make more like you rather make 200,000 just work under someone like someone's bossing you around all the time I mean, at the point in your life, you have to, you have to be of service to someone as well. Not really. I mean, you can be your own boss and make less. Like, you know what I mean? It's just like you're making less though. But you're, you'd be happier in life, I think, because you're doing what you want. You know? It depends, yeah. It depends. <laughs> <laughs> and you go enjoy that kind of pee just to. Yeah, see I guess like... so. Some people like being like under like someone like telling them what to do you know it's like constructive or whatever they can't do it on their own you know because some people don't have like the motivation to do it okay would you rather marry someone that is in prison or someone that is there with you but she did no <laughs> okay but okay well if he's in prison is he getting out soon no? no, he's not like so. never getting out. So like either way, I'm like not getting dick. Yeah. Okay, 
I think probably someone in prison. I mean, it depends on the thing on their personalities, but I'm not gonna be that bitch right now. Um, you can have like conjugal visits where you can like go and fuck them. You can. Do they, do they, they do let you do that. that. They do. They Look do? it up. Yeah. If you're in there, if you're in jail for like a long time, they'll like let you have like like conjugal visits or whatever, and like you guys can fuck. Sure. Yeah. Have you done that before? <laughs> no, I haven't. I know I haven't really dealt with anyone in jail. Like I know people that have went to jail. Like my one fuck buddy went to jail one time, and then like just never spoke to him again. And then this one guy would like send me letters from jail to my mom's house, what? and my mom like found it, and she like works at the jail, and she was, she like knew the guy, and she was like, what the fuck? Like, but I wasn't even into him. Like he he just found me at the club. And then was like, got my Snapchat and like was like trying to talk to me and I really wasn't trying to talk to him. And then he sent me money all disrespectfully. Like he sent me money like I've never sent, like seen money before. You know what I mean? Like a cash of like a picture, like saying like, oh I have money. Like I don't care. I've been around with like people that have money. You know what I mean? So it's just he's so weird. But yeah, it was interesting. He actually got punched out at the club because like he was like talking to me for a little bit. And then like, like I didn't even know him. He just came up, talked to me, and then left. And then some other guy just punched him because he was like mad that he was talking to me. Club here. Yeah. Wow. It was at Habanos actually. And it was like it's just weird because like I don't know either of you, so like there's no reason for you to go punch someone just. Did he bounce out? React. No, he punched him and then like oh yeah, I think he got kicked out. Like he had to like he like really hurt his nose or something. Like I don't know. It was really weird. Yeah, Regina's crazy. Like Regina's actually like. Crazy, like I don't know, like people. <laughs> <laughs> Where well, was they like, ah, oh, bro? Like, do you go to clubs here? I'm not. I just moved like recently, so I'm not really. So if I go somewhere, the first, the first weekend that comes up, I'm popping up in the club and so there. I'm like, well, I want to see what the club life's like, like you know. Like, like here. For a week, like you have to calm down and like think and um, structure everything before you start moving out. Know? I guess so. I guess I gotta make sure everything's settled. Yeah. Like, okay, I got you. I got you. So you've never been to any club yet? Not yet. Oh. Today is Friday. Yeah, today is Friday. We I guess could. where I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> the club. Over it? Yeah, of course. It's Friday. Where, where, where? I don't know. I was thinking going to the lot. Like, you know, my friends want to go to the lot. Usually, we, like, we've been going to hookah, but like it just got shot up. So we're like, oh, it's gonna be right now. I don't really want to go there right now. Like, so you're going to pick them up? Um, no, like, we're probably just going to all meet somewhere, like, get ready and then go. So I have to leave by 9 30, but yeah. <laughs> straight there? No, not straight there. I'm probably going to go home maybe first. Because you don't go to the club at this time. You go at like 11, 12, you know? Girls got to get ready. Like, I don't know what guys do before they go to the club, but like, we actually put effort into our shit, okay? <laughs> Like, guys put a hoodie on and we'll call it a day. Let's go. <laughs> anyway, okay, your turn. No, you Is it my turn? Mm -hmm. Okay. Would you rather eat McDonald's for the rest of your life or one yeah, really true, true, good... True. We could actually, like, you know, most of the videos that they do, like, they do, like, around the club. Oh, like, t like filming in the club? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I vlog in the club all the time. Yeah, like, mm -hmm. you know when... Lots of people like are coming out, then you be asking them like all these public interviews. Oh yeah, but like they won't like that at the club. It depends which club you go no, to. You like, go that when they coming out, not in the club, like outside the club. Oh, out outside. Yeah. It depends where you're, where you, because the vagina. Like if you do that at hookah, like I don't know, they don't want to be filmed, right? Because it's like a bunch of like all the pimps go there, all the like drug dealers go there, you know? They don't want to be on camera. But if you go to Gabs. They'll be like, sure, like, let's, like, freaking, like, let's be, like, they're just, like, you know. I mean, obviously, they'll be, like, younger guys, they're, like, mm -hmm. We should do that in a mall, like, like, I think that would be better, like, going to, like, Cornwall or something. Like, I know my friend's done that before, and, like, she was, like, oh, they're nice, and, like, they didn't kick you out. I bet, like, if we do it outside, like, I don't know, there's also, like, a lot of, like, homeless people that just sit outside the clubs and, like, ask for money and stuff, like, all of them, pretty much. You know, because they know it's like Friday and Saturday and they go out and just stand Yeah, but then it's not like you're going to do it like at the entrance. Like maybe two blocks away. I don't know. I feel like two blocks away, no one's going to be there. Like when they're coming out from the club. 
something like that maybe i don't know because like when they're coming everyone's out everyone's going to be like yeah everyone's going to be like Hi. yeah i guess so so maybe. whatever you ask them they'll just want to yeah say whatever yeah. maybe okay like maybe we'll see <laughs> yeah to do that anyway it was my turn okay um would you rather eat mcdonald's for the rest of your life or have like one nice meal from a restaurant but you have to eat the same meal over again like at least mcdonald's you get variety so <laughs> McDonald's? <laughs> I know. You don't like it? Mate, no, it's good. It's just like, uh, like you get so sick of it. Like I'm already sick of McDonald's. I've already no. had it so many times. <laughs> I was sick of Subway at the point. But... Oh yeah, I had Subway so many times. <laughs> Apparently their bread's not even bread. It's like, not like they can't even say it's bread anymore because there's so much sugar in it. It doesn't count as bread. Like that's so fucked. Like if you really think about that. Like shit. Anyway, okay, you can ask the last question. Uh, um, and don't make it about OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather? Um, Would you rather live alone for the rest of your life, or live with someone you don't like at all? Mm. Live alone. Alone? Oh yeah. Like you can't do anything. With anyone? Like just in a room. That's fine. I'm honestly like I'm chilling. If I have my phone, I'm good. Alone in a room. Yeah. <laughs> then someone I hate. Mm -hmm. Like yeah, cause like it just make it so much worse. Like at least I like myself, you know. Like I can have my phone. Like I don't want to be like oh like just when your social battery runs out or whatever, and there's someone in the room you don't like. Just, oh my god, that'd be so annoying. I'd hate that. I'd absolutely hate that. Anyway, yeah, so that was all for this video. It's a wrap. Yeah. And again, his link will be in the description. You already know, like, comment, subscribe, and that's it.